Twisted Wonderland OC Challenge but different. Disclaimer This OC Challenge will mainly focus on the life of your OC and less on the character's appearances. Oh and also some of the parts here are from a Twisted Wonderland Zodiac thing I found on Wattpad so credit to the authors since I forgot their names lol. You can choose age, skin, and gender. We'll focus a little bit on looks after we see the dorms. The dorm your OC is in is going to be based on your zodiac sign. If you are a Libra, then your OC will be in Diasomnia. If you are a Taurus or Virgo, then your OC will be in Hearts Labial. If you are a Scorpio or Leo, then your OC will be in Savannah Claw. If you are a Gemini, then your OC will be in Ignahide. If you are an Aquarius or Cancer, then your OC will be in Octavianel. If you are an Aries, then your OC will be in Scarabia. If you are a Pisces or Capricorn, then your OC will be in Pomifiori. For looks you can either base it off of yourself, a dream look that you really like, or another Disney character. Just note if you're basing your OC on a Disney character. It's best to choose a character that fits in the dorm you're in. Now pick a number between 1 and 3. If you chose 1, then your OC must not be a human magician. If you choose 2, then your OC will have a familiar. If you chose 3, then you can choose or have both. If you are an optimist, then your OC will have a low chance of overblotting. If you are a pessimist, then your OC will have a high chance of overblotting. If you are a realist, optimistic realist, or pessimistic realist, then you can choose if your OC will overblot. If your OC does have a chance of overblotting, then put the reason why and put how they would look like in their overblot form. Now for unique magic. Your OC's unique magic should be something that fits with how you made your OC's looks. If you made your OC's looks based off of another Disney character, then you must come up with a unique magic that fits with your Disney character of choice. If you made your OC's looks based off of yourself, then it's best to try and find key parts of yourself and try to turn it into a unique magic. If you're having a hard time choosing a unique magic, then you can say that they don't have a unique magic. Looks like we're done. All that's left is to give them an awesome backstory and personality to bring the character to life. I apologize if the challenge was too easy lol. Have fun making your OC.